Amy, why did you choose to come to Long Road? Um, originally, I didn't choose to come to Long Road. It was my second choice. I actually didn't get into the sixth form I wanted to get into. And like when I first found out I didn't get in, I was like almost heartbroken in a way. I was like really upset that I wouldn't be with like all my friends. And like I was going to a college where I didn't know anyone else was going. Yeah. Um, but it was genuinely the best thing that ever happened because this is going to sound really cringy, but like I found where I belong, if that makes sense. Like I found some of the mm-hmm. best friends. I'm doing subjects like I genuinely enjoy with teachers that like understand how to help me grow as a person and like help teach me and like there's genuinely nothing I would change because like I've ended up somewhere like absolutely amazing it's like it is scary like when you don't get into where you want but like I don't know I really enjoy it Rosie why did you choose to come to Long Road? Long Road was always my first choice because um, in my opinion, it has the best um, campus out of all the sixth forms I visited. And it also included all the courses I wanted to do. Um, it's also a lot different from secondary school because I wanted a change and a lot of other sixth forms um, are attached to secondary schools. Mm-hmm. Tegan, why did you choose to come to Long Road? I felt that it was my first choice because like as soon as you come here the atmosphere is so nice and like you make so many friends the people that come here are so much like you and they don't the teachers focus on you rather than your grades obviously they care about your grades and they help you achieve them but they care about your health, uh, well-being as well definitely Dom why did you come to Long Road um well like Amy um Long Road wasn't my first choice but I um, I really do enjoy being at Long Road um, because, um, like other people have said, it's a very um, different experience to secondary school. It's more grown up, um, if that's a better term. Um, and it is an excellent place to be because the teachers genuinely care about their students. And it's a very diverse place and they're very accepting of everybody. So it's and that's why. I like Long Road. Yeah. Kat, why did you choose Long Road? Like you and Dom, it wasn't my first choice. But um, I definitely enjoy it now. And um, I chose to come to Long Road because I always wanted to do science. And I heard that, like, their science was really good as well. Amy, apart from science, what other subjects do you take? I take history and I do the Russian strand at Long Road and I also do English Lit and Lang. Tegan, what other subjects do you take? I take another BTEC, which is health and social care, so it's like two lessons in one. A double subject? Yeah. Kat, what uh, other subjects do you take? I take A-level art and then um, I do the BTEC criminology. Rosie, what subjects do you take other than science? I take A-level sociology and B-tech criminology. Dot, what other subjects do you take? Uh, I take A-level product design and B-tech computing. Rosie, what do you want to do when you leave sixth form? Um, I really want to go to uni. I don't know what I want to study yet, but I think I want to go into medicine. So science is really going to help me with what I want to do when I'm older. Kat, what do you want to do when you leave sixth form? Um, I want to go to Lincoln University to either stud, um, study biochem or law. Amy, what do you want to do when you leave sixth form? I want to go to uni and study history and then do a history teaching degree on top of that. Dom, what do you want to do when you leave sixth form? Um, I have um, my options open at the moment, really. Um, I feel like an apprenticeship would be a good option for me, um, like an engineering apprenticeship. But I also think that university is a good route to take and get a, um, a qualification in a higher subject. And then I can go into 
maybe another apprenticeship after that with another company. But I have my options open at the moment. Tegan, what do you want to do when you leave Long Road? I want to go to university to study to study midwifery. Um, Amy, what do you enjoy about the course? Um, I love the practicals. Personally, I really enjoy like doing the practicals. And I also love the fact that we learn in, at like GCSE in secondary school, but we're applying it to a higher level. So we we learn new things as well as using stuff we had already learned. Um, Tegan, what do you enjoy about the course? I also really enjoy the practicals, but I also like the fact that Denise puts us within different pairs. So then as a class, we all know each other, we can get to know each other and we just like, bond through the pra practicals. So it's a more chill sort of environment so we can help each other out and what some people's strengths be, it'll be the other person's weakness. So we can learn together to be to do a really effective um experiment um cat what do you enjoy about the course um i enjoy that um like the others have said you get more practicals whereas if i had taken biology it'd have been a lot more exam based so it is nicer to be like have more control almost over your own like subjects and also like the friends i've made in my science are, like so different to like my other courses like I've, all of my courses, I'm definitely closer with the applied science like class. John, what do you enjoy about the course? Um, well, I enjoy having all three subjects at once um, because lots of people want to do multiple sciences, but then also get stuck with the uh, decision whether to take multiple sciences and drop other subjects or take just one science which is not their preference so people that want to do multiple sciences it's a really good option because you can do all the science that you want and you still get a, a good BTEC grade from it and you can do other subjects as well. Rosie what do you enjoy about the course? Um, well originally I wanted to do um, A level biology but um, I also really enjoyed chemistry at secondary, so I'm glad that all of the lessons are put together. And also I agree with Kat, like the science class is the class I'm actually closest with and who I am friends with more people in. So, Kat, why did you choose applied science? Um, I chose applied science because um, I always wanted to do like something to do with science and although like um, I didn't get into my original subject um, I'm really glad that I did get into the applied science and if I could like um, it, I wouldn't change anything because applied science is definitely the best subject for me like I said before you have the most control over it. Sorry, Why did you choose applied science? Um, I chose applied science because I didn't get a high enough grade in physics but then I realised that actually applied science was a better subject for me because I also enjoyed um, the other two sciences but I didn't I wasn't going to get the opportunity to study them further but now that I'm doing applied science um, I feel that it's actually a really good option because also the the end grade that you get still counts as an A-level, which lots of people don't um, realise when they go and join a sixth form college, and you actually get a really good grade from a, a really good result from doing it, and it's also a really good mix of the subjects, so that's why I chose it. Rosie, why did you choose applied science? Um, I didn't get a high enough grade in maths to do biology A-level, so um, I still wanted to do something to do with science and I got into the applied science course and I'm really glad I um, took that instead because obviously includes the other sciences which I wouldn't have been able to do if I didn't take applied science so I'm really glad I did. Tegan why did you choose applied science? I chose applied science because I've always struggled with exams and the fact that it's half coursework, half exams, like just makes me feel better because then you don't have to revise loads. Well, you obviously have to revise, but you don't 
have to revise for lots of different subjects like if I was going to do biology and chemistry and physics and then it's also going to help me with my future career of being a midwife. Amy why did you choose applied science? Um, so originally I was going to do English Lit and Lang A level, History A level and RPE RE A level but then I sort of thought that might be a bit too much for me to handle so I was looking at other um, courses I could take that I qualified for and I saw Applied Science and I thought it was an overall well-rounded subject that could just help me with whatever I wanted to end up doing in later in life because it's quite a sort of covers all the three subjects it doesn't pinpoint one specific um like job or like thing that you want to do so I thought that's why I chose it because I thought it was like a good well-rounded subject that could help me like in later life Um, Tegan, what advice would you give yourself if you was to come to Long Road this year? Well, with before I come to Long Road, I'd say revising is best, but also like as you're coming into Long Road and say if you did want to go to a different college, like I feel like everything works out. Like I want to do biology, but I know that if I did actually do that and I got the grace to do biology then I wouldn't have enjoyed it because it would be so much hard work but so not to get disappointed if you don't get into your right course or the right college because it will all work out. Yeah definitely. Rosie what advice would you give yourself if you were to come to Long Road this year? Well um, like Tegan I was also really um, sad that I didn't get into biology because that's what I thought I really wanted to do. But um, I know there's a lot of work in A-level biology, um, so I'm really glad that I went with applied science. Amy, what advice would you give yourself if you used to come to Long Road this year? Um, I would just tell myself not to worry. Like, even if you're coming from a school where, like, you don't know anybody else that's going, to long road if you don't know anyone else that's going to be there don't worry because like everyone's so friendly the teachers are so helpful like just try to like stay calm and just enjoy it because it goes so quickly like I felt like it's just gone so quickly and we're only you're only there for two years so just like enjoy it and yeah enjoy it yeah so, what advice would you give yourself if you was to come to Long Road this year? Um, if I was coming this year, I'd probably tell myself a bit of everything that everybody here has said already. Because, like Amy said, you can you really do make friends quickly because it's a very um, friendly environment. All the teachers care, like genuinely care about you. Um, and it's when people come and they realise that they can't get into a course, lots of people get very um, anxious and upset about that but it does generally work out very well like with me I didn't get high enough grades for physics but now I've ended up doing applied science which is an excellent course which I really enjoy and lots of people that I know that have gone to Long Road and haven't got into the courses they wanted to do they've also ended up with excellent courses that they really enjoy maybe even more than the ones that they were going to take. Mm -hmm. Kat, what advice would you give yourself if you were coming to Long Road this year? I'd say not to panic. Like, um, even if you don't get the grades that you originally like hoped for, there's always an option for you here. Like, um, the teachers would always find a way to get around it. And like, yeah, one hundred percent. Really, definitely work hard. Like, don't just like dot about because like you're not gonna get like the grades you want. Like at the end of the day, like I think. That you should just like work a lot harder and just like but then again like don't worry about like things like friendships because everyone's in the same position when you come like no one really knows each other and you're in the same position yeah 